last, the two scoops of a vanilla Amazing. protein powder. Love that protein so, powder. Whiz that all up. So that was like 30 seconds. Yeah. Amazing. Amazing. Okay. All right. Sorry. And so I've just got the oven on 180. Mm -hmm. um, and then we put in for about 20 minutes. Yeah. Check it after 20. And what's when it's cooked, um, we made one earlier <laughs> just to check what it was like. And it's really quite yummy just as a little snack even. Um, or you can have for breakfast. You could even toast it in the toaster, oh, yeah. like banana bread. But really yummy. What do we have? We could do... Put the cream Yeah, we've got cheese. the dairy-free um, Liddell's cream cheese that you can find that at Woolies. Um, you could do the nut butter. You could do any nut butter. What else could you add on to it? You could even add a bit of Nutella. Oh, that would be naughty. It's not um, 30 days approved, but it's an option for the kitties. Um, what else would you put on it? What did I just have? Um, nut butter and cinnamon. Well, that sounds nice. Yeah. Okay. So the oven's on 180. We've had a sprinkle pretty. Uh, nuts. Uh, nuts on top. Oh, that's and that's just a mixture of pepitas. <laughs> Almonds. Sunflower seeds. Sunflower seeds. Pop that in. And we'll just put the timer on to about 20. Alright, we'll do that. Sorry, 20 minutes. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Live videos. Okay. And then we'll show you. The one we prepared the finished product. Yeah, so this is our it's so delicious. I'll just quickly show you with my fingers. Mm. So yummy. So, what are okay. you going to make? Oh, so thanks, Taylor. So, I'm going to do the chocolate. Now, I don't need the cinnamon mix for that. This one's a bit more simpler. A lot of the, um, I'll show you. Do you want me to show you before we make it? So, I'm just going to. Oh, yeah, we. We, we made, made some earlier. Bark. Yeah, chocolate bark. So, this is. This is a foolproof. A lot of people use this, have made this within our oven community and they share all our recipes. Sky always makes this, love it. Um, you've made it before, haven't you? Have you made this before? No, I haven't. Oh, okay. So what we do, I've got three scoops of the coconut oil. I was, I was going to um, melt this yeah. in the microwave. So I'm just going to do maybe a minute, see what happens there. And then we're just going to add some bits and pieces. Um, you could really put anything on top. Nice. Yeah, so I've done... You can also some peanut butter too on top. Peanut butter. So yeah. we've done the swirl. So what you can do is... What we do is we get a bit of paper in the tray. Baking paper. And then you can just sprinkle some raspberries or sprinkle some almond butter, some peanut butter, any sort of butter base basically. Cashew butter on it. And then you just pour the chocolate on top once we do the next step. Um, I've done it before with like crushed almonds. You can buy trail mix, so you can do little ones. I'm just going to do a big one and break it up into the bar, like that one. But you can do like little circles, dollops of chocolate, buy some trail mix from the supermarket and just sprinkle it over, put it in the freezer. That's a really good option as well. Um, let's check my oil. Oh, yeah. Beautiful, so just do a little, little one to show you. So that's the oil, then we're gonna add in the rice bowl syrup. I'm just gonna do how much do you put? I don't really measure, but about I'm gonna do about a tablespoon. And mix that in. I prefer the rice malt, do you use rice malt? I sometimes use I prefer or maple normally syrup. use maple. Yeah, you can either or I just find I don't know, like they come out with stuff like this and they say it's healthy and like who knows if it is, but I quite like it so it is gluten-free. It's an all-natural sweetener. Um, it's quite nice. So I just stir that in. 
Then we're just going to add, can you see that? Oops, mix in. Don't worry. I'll just, um, live TV, huh? So I'm just gonna do, this is raw cacao that I just get from a local grocer. I'm just gonna pop that in, stir that around. This is so simple, the kids could do this with you. Like, really. Mm, easy. See how it's water, can you see how it's watery? And then we're gonna add, um, this is the chocolate. So we're very protein tonight, aren't we? This is the protein. So I'm just gonna do two scoops. Um, it's very wet and cold here in, here in Geelong. It's so freezing, isn't it? It's, today was horrible. Do you wanna see this? Horrible and cold. So yeah, just mix that around. And that's basically it. So what, coconut oil, rice malt syrup, and chocolate protein. You could use any different protein. You could do the strawberry protein. I wonder what that'd be like. Yeah, that'd be nice. It might be, yeah. You could add the greens into this. A little bit of greens, a bit of health. And then this is all we do. Uh, we just wanna just pour, look at that. How nice is that? Delicious. And then we're just gonna sprinkle any toppings like we said before, any nuts. Just got some um, shaved coconut here. Just gonna sprinkle. And then we've got some fresh raspberries. And I'm just gonna break some up like so. In the kitchen with Taylor and Fran. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're going to do um, I'll just show you what I do next, the next stage. Just pop this over here in the freezer. And then, 